Welcome back to Good Morning Vale. We are all giggles this morning. I am with the lovely, gorgeous Ava Akers and Chelsea Bow. How are you doing, you guys? We're, We're excited, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and they are here for No Right Way, the amazing film I am stoked to watch. I know all about this. And I have to say, just before we dive right in, you guys are full of energy and full of love and light and just oh. beautiful. How is this? And I can tell that you have such a good working relationship. Oh. How did this all come to be your friendship? Good question. Um, really <laughs> just through, um, so I directed No Right Way. Yes. Ava is a co-star and we. I found Ava, our lovely casting directors help us find Ava, but I feel like pretty immediately we hit you it know. off. Yeah. Yeah. And we just, yeah. Well, and Chelsea, you're the, you're a writer, director, and you're starring in the film. Yes. Can and we take a moment and just thank you? That is a big deal. Thank you. Amazing. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. She um, she does it all. <laughs> literally. I'm like, yes, you do all of it. That's incredible. To have that type of mind writing, directing, and acting, co-starring in this film. Yeah. It's, it's been a journey. Um, and I couldn't have done it without the crew and my husband, who's my producing partner, and just like the support of everyone, you know. I love that. Takes a village. Well, and we should say Sean Drummond as well is yes. the producer. Yeah. And I heard that he's very close to us this morning. <laughs> he is. I'm like, if we could here. pan over to the left. <laughs> so, No Right Way. It's all about, tell me if I'm correct, yes. a tween, or yes. we like to say teeny bopper, yeah. <laughs> that is forced to live with her half-sister. Yes. And what ensues? Is it good? Is it bad? Tell us a little bit about the film. Sure, <laughs> yeah. So, Harper has... Um, control tendencies okay. and that doesn't fare well when she's taking care of Georgie who's very independent for her age mm -hmm. and kind of you know as she's trying to step into this like parenting role as a 20 something year old woman um, it doesn't go as planned <laughs> as it never does yeah. <laughs> and um, it kind of leads to exposing like their pair their parallel childhood wounds that's so. what I was so interested in when I yeah. was reading all about the film I think that's such a cool moment in the story that you're able to connect and see where both of you are wounded and both of yes. you have this pain and this hurt from the way you were raised. That's yeah. a very interesting, I don't think that's been, I've never heard of that And before. they're half sisters, so yes. they have the same dad, different moms, so, and they're raised very differently, but they mm -hmm. do have some. Similar. Yeah. And I think they bond by finding humor in the tough situations, which is what I love, yeah. you know, just to lead your life with that kind of message of, you know, find the funny in the bad times. I and love I, that. They kind of relate in that way, but I don't think, yeah. Georgie wouldn't want to admit that. <laughs> Fair. Well, and but. I think that's, that's such truth for life, right? Like, yeah. there are things that hurt, and it's not always easy, but you have to find kind of, you're right, you can laugh or cry. And sometimes it's okay to feel the way you want to feel, but sometimes you have to laugh. because Sometimes you do it at the same time. Exactly. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I've done Very that. Very true. Oh, Me too, girl. <laughs> so, No Right Way, where was it filmed, and how long did it take to film as yeah, well? Yeah, so we filmed it in between Los Angeles and Vegas, a little bit awesome. of both, mostly in L.A., outskirts of L.A., and it took about... 20-ish days. Wow. Yeah, with pickups and everything. Wow. Yeah. yeah. 20 days. Yeah. That's insane. That's amazing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Thank what you. were the hours like? <laughs> we were doing 12-hour days, which mm -hmm. is, um, and Ava at the time was 18, yeah. which wow. it was her first job as uh, an adult. Before yeah. then, she's been working since she was three years was three, old. Yeah. So That's she's a amazing. freaking pro. Oh my <laughs> gosh, you guys. I'm like, talk about powerful women right here. Thank oh, you. Thank that you. is brilliant. Yeah. But it, and it seems like you guys just really connect on a level, you're a friendship level. We're and I family bet, now. Yeah. I she's my wait. sister in real life, too, at I this love, point. Yeah. I love that because I can't wait to see that on the screen. I'm sure Thanks. it's so, it just <laughs> bounces off and you can feel that energy together. You definitely thank can you. feel it. So we've yeah. been told. Yeah, so yeah, we've been told. I've been told the chemistry is there, the family aspect is yeah. there. So. so the whole concept of the film is kind of working through these childhood wounds that yeah. you both have yeah. and the feeling of you being independent and wanting to go your own way and then having mm -hmm. someone pull you back and have mm -hmm. this moment of, no, you can't do you. You have to kind of follow my rules. Was that hard for you guys to play the different mm. characters or was it easy? <laughs> do, do you, you want to first? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, because <laughs> I feel like 
it kind of felt natural for me to be on that other side of like the independent side because right. it's tough for me to admit sometimes when I need help and to ask for that help. 100%. Um, and <laughs> I love advice, but I don't like to admit that I, I desperately need help. Yeah. <laughs> don't we all? Right. Yeah, so I think that that was what I pulled from my own self to play this character because she is so different from me in a lot of ways, but yeah. that aspect of it was very, like, that was kind of my stubbornness. and That, that. relatable. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I really, I really uh, resonated with that part of Georgie. Yeah. And I don't know, I mean. Yeah, yeah and heart, so the story is inspired by um, my sister and I and, and experiences we shared. Real life. Yes. Love this. Yes. Okay. So um, Harper is a version of me, but she's definitely more uptight than I am. <laughs> um, I have some of that, but Harper's like, Next level. Yeah. I um, love your energy. You're like, I am way more chill. Let me just like she tell really everyone is. before For the you record. see the film. I am way more chill. Yes, well, so that's you guys brilliant. Know. And that's yeah. such an interesting moment, too, because you're playing yourself yeah. pretty much did you find I, for me that would be hard truly because I know just like what yeah. you said you have yeah. to um, take it to a different level where you're like maybe I have some of these tendency tendencies right. however I'm not that crazy you know <laughs> yes. yeah yeah and Harper um, yeah she's definitely kind of the antagonist a little bit in the film mm -hmm. so that yeah. was it was it was fun to play and uh, yeah I think I think the hardest part was writing it, actually. Really? I think playing it was uh, surprisingly easier than like doing, because that's when you do all the work is like in the writing phase. and That's what I was going to ask you. Was yeah. it so very cathartic for you to write this? Because you're living your life again. <laughs> yes. And you're going, <laughs> yes. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> These are great. I love that. <laughs> Come back tomorrow. We'll oh. be here. <laughs> so I can't imagine, yeah, that it has to be really cathartic, but also I'm sure there were some tears, some funny moments. How, oh, tell yeah. us about, yeah, take Emotional us on that journey. Roller coaster. Yeah. And my little sister, who's 19, um, she was on set the entire time too. Yeah. Wow. So it really was an emotional roller coaster. Did she talk to you a little bit about? Yeah, she really guided me through um, approaching the scenes that were. Cl more closely to like her real life and okay. what really happened um, and we got close and oh. we talked all the time I just wanted to make sure that I knew everything that I needed to to do those scenes and, and play that part but did she's that put awesome. a weight on your because mm -hmm. what you're saying I love that because you guys are such genuinely kind humans and I know for you I can tell you guys obviously take this very seriously and it's your passion and you're good at what you do was that hard a little bit just to be like oh I want to make sure that I depict you in the right light in the right way that's like a lot of pressure <laughs> I think so but it, I felt really fortunate to have her there to talk to me and she's so open and so um, she was so vulnerable and right. strong and just really honest. And oh, we kind of had to just be that vulnerable and honest with ourselves and each other to get to those points. So I was glad that I had her there to kind of tell me things or she gave me like the music she listened to when she was 13 and I would listen to that That's on set so cool. and just fill my mind with that time of her life. Wow. Um, but You're literally walking in her shoes, which is really... <laughs> yeah, yes. in a way, yeah. yeah. So, there, I mean, there's definitely a pressure. I want to be, you know, I want to do her justice and yeah. like, make her happy with it. But also, it's... I think I had some leeway because it is yeah. a separate character. Yeah, right. So it's, it's not right. Yeah, sure. yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah. Well, yeah. Every time you say that now, I'm just laughing because you're like, I am not that crazy. <laughs> I just and thought Georgie I was think and yes. Alana aren't identical either, no, no. but there's pieces of Alana. Yeah, you can take them. Pieces of me, yeah, for sure. Yeah. And Ava. Made so it's it fun to pick and pull and, and yeah. just see what yeah. you want to add in there. Uh, ladies, yeah. you got me really excited. <laughs> I am super stoked. And Thank tell us all what time because I know you have kind of a big uh, time slot. <laughs> yeah, we're the closing night film, which yes. we're super excited about. Um, we're screening on Saturday at 7.30 p.m. at the Cascade, Cascade. Theater. Awesome. Um, at the Grand Hyatt. So that we're is super excited so about excited. it. Yeah. <laughs> you got me really excited, so I can And only... Ava's winning an award, so. Oh, let's talk, okay, real quick. <laughs> Ava, what award are you winning, I already? 
I'm being honored with the Rising Star Award. That's amazing. It's crazy. Oh, I can't believe it. It couldn't happen to a nicer human being. You're oh, lovely. You guys thank you both. So, so are you. You thank love you. my yeah, heart. True, 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 true. I'm like, I'm That's not so crazy. <laughs> That's all. Every time I see you now, I'm going to be like, girl. <laughs> After I watch the movie, I'm going to be like, what you really like? <laughs> well, I can't wait to check it out. I will be there. You guys are thank brilliant. You. Thank you so much. And for people that can't maybe make it on Saturday, yeah. um, is there somewhere else they can check it out? So it's not online yet, but um, we're keeping everyone in the loop through social media. So at No Right Way Movie on Instagram cool. and at No Right Way Film on Facebook. And we'll tell everyone where it ends up so awesome. that when it finds distribution. Awesome. Yeah, we can share it with everyone. Well, ladies, you are amazing. Check out the film. I hope to see you Saturday night, The Cascade. And keep it right here. We have more Good Morning Veil to come.